really waiting to make your decision about health care until you saw the bill and it just came out. And what yeah, you and we'll talk to you about that later. Yeah, but there's not going to be time. I'm just curious if you okay, have to speak with right Shane, now. please. But you don't. Sick and tired of you guys. The last time you came in here, you did the same thing. Get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. The last guy did the same thing. You were the guardian? Yes, and you just broke my glasses. The last guy did the same damn thing. You just body slammed me and broke my glasses. <laughs> Unstable much? A statement from Gianforte's campaign reads in part, after asking Jacobs to lower the recorder, Jacobs declined. Greg then attempted to grab the phone that was pushed in his face. Jacobs grabbed Greg's wrist and spun away from Greg, pushing them both to the ground. Continuing the quote, it's unfortunate that this aggressive behavior from a liberal journalist created this scene at our campaign volunteer barbecue. Of course, that's not exactly what happened. Alicia Acuna is live in Bozeman, Montana, about an hour and a half south of the capital there. Helena, what, that, is that what you saw? What, what did you see? You were right there. Yeah, I was uh, two feet, maybe three feet from the two men when this started, Shep, and uh, that is not what I saw. Uh, we were talking to Gianforte right before our interview, our photographer, Keith Raley, our field producer, Faith Mangan. We were all together in this f relatively small room setting up for an interview that we had planned. He came in, Gianforte, and we started talking about restaurants and things in, Mon in Bozeman specifically. And then about two minutes in, Ben Jacobs came in, said he was with The Guardian, uh, put his recorder up about... Out here, standard location from what I've seen, and started asking about the CBO score, the Congressional Budget Office score, and his reaction. Uh, that's when June Forte said that he didn't, you know, he would get to him later. Uh, Jacobs persisted, and then June Forte said, you know, talk to Shane, who was his press guy. And at that point, um, and I was looking right at the two men. At that point, that's when GM Forte put both hands on either side of his neck, grabbed him, um, grabbed Jacobs, uh, threw him to the ground against this wall on the ground, uh, got on top of him, not really straddling, but just kind of over him, uh, punched him about two or three times and was saying, um, I'm really sick and tired of this, something to that effect. Uh, and then we saw uh, Jacobs, I, I saw him, um, he scrambled away. He was on his knees. He was all the sat and his glasses were broken. He said, you broke my glasses. You just body slammed me. And there was, I was in shock. And so were Keith and Faith that we were just really could not believe this just happened it, cause, because it went from a very calm, cordial uh, discussion to just this craziness. So, so, so first he body so, slammed and then they put out a statement today and in the statement he lied about it. The statement does not reflect anything that I remember. It's not what F uh, Keith and Faith remember either. So no, it's not. It's well, not. It's not what happened. The, it's it, simply the, not what happened. The timing this reporter is, is was doing his job, and yeah, yeah. The timing, Alicia, is is really stunning. I mean, this was the night before the special election, where in a in a, in a state Trump won by 20 points. Right. Yeah, but Democrats can win here, too. That's what's made this such an interesting race. But what's also interesting, Shep, and the polls close at 8 o'clock uh, mountain time. The polls close at 8 o'clock. But 37 percent of the absentee ballots of the voters here in Montana have already sent in their ballots. And there were people today who were complaining and saying they wanted to change their vote. Now, they want to change their vote. Some who voted for uh, Rob Quist, the Democrats, said they want to change it to Jim Forte because of this. Some people want to go the other way. So it's hitting on both, different, to both sides in different ways. You know, it's just it's strange. Alicia Acuna, a witness to it all. Bum, that camera wasn't rolling, but I think we got the gist there. See you soon. Thank you.